Marin, who became the world's youngest prime minister when she took office aged 34 last year, posed for the October issue of Trendy magazine wearing a blazer with no shirt underneath. Mari Palos Arlo Justin Mackey Director of Women's Media at Eledit Magazine Group, publisher of Trendy, told CNN that there was an be enormous backlash against the photo shoot and cover story in Finland. She said the magazine received fierce criticism on social media soon after it was released on October 9th. If you had to generalize it, it will be men saying it was wrong. And women saying it was fabulous, Paolo Salo, Justin Mackey said. It was a little bit surprising, she said, adding, We've had that sort of photo before, obviously, in a woman's glossy fashion magazine. We have portrayed women in blazes with nothing underneath for years and years, with famous people. And they had never created any response like this. Carlos Arlo Justin Mackey told CNN that many critics of the cover story seemed upset that the Prime Minister had featured in a women's lifestyle magazine. And some were angry that she did so as the government deals with the coronavirus pandemic. This was seen as a waste of the Prime Minister's time, she said. I think it speaks of women being tired and fed up with being restricted and told how to act and look and behave and being judged by their looks. If you're young and beautiful, then you can't be taken seriously, Paolo Salo Justin Mackey said. Marin is far from the first female politician to face criticism for her appearance, both in public life and in magazine appearances. In 2016, former British Prime Minister Theresa May faced scrutiny from the tabloid press after being pictured in leather trousers for the Sunday Times magazine. Meanwhile, British lawmaker Tracy Braben was this year forced to respond to online trolls after receiving abuse on social media after her shoulder became exposed during a debate in the House of Commons, with some questioning if the MP's outfit was appropriate attire.